Okay, peeps. Today we're going to teach you that evolution is not real. One reason why we know that is because carbon dating cannot work because of the gravitational pull of the world. The world is losing gravitational pull. And since that it is losing gravitational pull, then it's getting weaker and stuff changes. Okay? You know, the gravitational pull actually affects the world quite a bit. And since the world is getting weaker, then carbon dating cannot work. It means carbon dating cannot work. I'll give you a few examples. There's just times where they find dinosaurs or mammoths that the skin is actually older than the inside, or one half of it's older than the other side, or one tusk is older than the other tusk. How does this make sense? I don't know. Maybe it's because evolution is not real and both have different similarities in them. And that carbon dating is not accurate at all. Neither is radiometric dating. There was this uh, mountain. I forgot it. I think it was... Uh, was it Metro Dome or Domo Capi 10? One of those. They said it was like 44 billion years old. But they say that it cooled over millions of years old when it was made. Well, first of all, I know that's not true. Because there's... Polonium-238, and Polonium-238 actually has a half-life of three, what was it, five, five, was it five seconds? Something like that. About five or six seconds, okay? That's not that long. However, there is a lot of Polonium frozen in there, Okay? All that polonium should have turned into its daughter element already. Which a daughter element is an element that it turns into after its half-life. Which would be lead or whatever. There's also uranium-238 in there. They say that the uranium-238 has a half-life of 4 point, mi four point something million years old. Years. Yeah, something like that. 4 point something million years. Okay. But... Uh, why? That don't make sense. If if that's the case, then why is there polonium frozen in there? And half of that polonium, actually all that polonium should be gone. If it was world, if that was millions of years old. But the, we can't prove that the half-life was for something million years old. We can't. We honestly can't. You cannot observe that. You cannot study that. And that's what science is. And a lot of this evolution theory is baloney. You cannot prove it. Now, I'm getting short on time because of the storage in my phone. So I encourage you guys to do your research. Get with Jesus. And watch all... And, and, and get with... You know, watch Hoven videos. Okay? Now, I'm going to be out in a minute. Please get with Jesus. Okay? Well, do your research. Look for proof of God, okay? People only hear what they want to hear. So hear what, what's the truth.